In this video, I'll show you how to hide the cursor in Camtasia recordings. Welcome to this video. My name is David. So quick scenario here. Let's assume you have a couple of mistakes when you're doing your screen recordings and the cursor moves almost everywhere. There are some sections where you might need to deactivate or hide the cursor so that it doesn't show the haphazardness when you are recording that particular section. So in this video, I'll show you how to hide the cursor from your particular recording inside Camtasia when editing your tutorial. So this is uh, the screen recording and clearly it's indicated. And one thing you'll notice if I scrub the timeline and you watch this particular section, the cursor is moving up and down. So what if you wanted to remove the cursor? My assumption is that I'm going to be removing this particular cursor from the whole project. So if you go to the cursor effects, there's no option to remove the cursor. So you might be wondering, where is it? It's right in front of you. So if you click on the screen or the screen recording, that is a T-Rex, you'll notice that there's a new option on this side. There's the media option, there's the audio option, and then there's the cursor properties. If you click on the cursor properties, you have the option to decrease the opacity. If I click on this and bring this down all the way down, where you are seeing my cursor, it will no longer be available. If you actually scrub the timeline, you'll notice that clearly the cursor is missing from the section before these particular animations. So if you actually wanted to hide the cursor for the whole presentation, ensure that you've not added any other animations before you do this particular change. Because if you do that particular change, see what happens. If we move over to this particular animation, the cursor comes back in. So the opacity comes back in, but you can just double click on that particular section and bring this particular opacity so that this cursor that you're seeing here is going to go down and out. And if we move again to the other section, you'll see it appear again. Yes, it goes again, if you notice here. So you can just double click on this particular animation and then just bring it down. So that is how you can hide a cursor in your Camtasia screen recordings and more so applicable when you don't want to show people the different haphazardness that you had in your recording. But Camtasia cursors are very important, especially if you're following a sequence and you want to draw people's attention to what you're doing. More so when you add the cursor effects, the highlights, the rings, the warps, and the sounds. So that is how you can hide the cursor in Camtasia. Thanks for watching. My name is David. Until next time, stay safe and never stop learning.